So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, uh, I have some good news. Finally, the the goddamn scheduler works for the Cortex M4 uh, processor that I was uh, you know going on and on about. And I'll show you guys what the hell am I doing. By the way, like look at all this all this assembly that I've written. Wait, yeah, look look at look at these instructions, man. All all these naked functions, because uh, God knows I can't see any naked girls in my life. But that's that's not like neither here nor there. Uh, yeah, the, the naked functions is the only thing that's that I'm seeing naked in my life these days. But uh, being on point. I'll, I'll show you guys what I've what I've done. So I have uh, you know written four uh, functions which are task handlers. Now if you look closely, they are while one and printing a very generic statement, right? So uh, you might be wondering, well, uh, while one should technically run forever, right? Then how the hell is the output on my console going from task one to task two to task three to task four? Well, uh, we have this thing called as a scheduler in order to do that, right? And uh, speaking of the scheduler, it runs on this 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 beautiful thing right here from ST Microelectronics. It's a Cortex M. Four based board. Uh, it's a uh, STM32F407 VGT RX, if, if I remember the part number correctly, because I'm just like that. Uh, yeah, what is happening is uh, basically I have written a scheduling algorithm uh, which like, gives time uh, or allocates uh, time to all these tasks. Uh, so it, it goes on for about uh, a one millisecond tick, which I have defined somewhere somewhere here. I'll, I'll, I'll you know put put the repo up. And, uh, and I mean, if anyone is interested, you guys can go and look at it. Now, for the sake of uh, transparency and for the sake of full honesty, there's this course on, on Udemy by Fastbit EBA. Uh, this what you see on your screen right here. So this guy gives the idea for this, uh, this entire thing. He has implemented the whole thing as a project and that is what I have tried to recreate. Uh, I have, uh, you know, tried to go and actually open uh, this this thing right here this 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 beautiful bastard right here which is like my Bhagavad Gita for for the past week and a half and uh, yeah I have uh, went and deep dived into every single uh, assembly instruction that I've that I've used here tried to know what uh, you know every single one of these things do which I'm pretty good at right now I, I know how to navigate through assembly now arm assembly uh, which is I, I still can't believe that this is my life right but uh, yeah uh, huge 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 shout out to to this guy I'll open the course right here so this is the course which I have purchased uh, not pirated because I have money now right I have purchased this course and for full honesty uh, I have tried to recreate and re-implement uh, the, the project which was suggested and implemented by Fastbit EBA and Kiran Nayak. God damn that guy is good. Uh, I tried to write the whole thing by myself. Of course I, I came into uh, issues and, and bugs for which I, I used the repo and the video lectures that, that the guy was explaining from. And uh, yeah, that's how I've done this. Now, uh, as of now, uh, you know, as you can quite clearly see, the 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 scheduler basically prints uh, some sort of printf statements uh, through open OCD debugging, right? The the next part is to implement uh, LED blinking uh, for each and every single one uh, of, of these tasks. So what am I going on about? Uh, there are four onboard LEDs. I believe you can see them right here. This is one, two, three, and four. So this is the fourth, the third, the the first, the second and the first. So the, the idea now will be to, uh, instead of just print something it will be to write led uh, blinking subroutines and then pass it on to all of these tasks which will then get scheduled by by uh, the scheduler and then on top of it i plan on implementing custom scheduling algorithms as well so as of now this is just a round robin scheduler i plan on uh, trying to include first come first serve trying to implement uh, you know shortest job first and, and a couple of uh, other scheduling algorithms as well do i know how am i going to do that no but I will figure it out anyways uh, this video has gone quite long but uh, yeah boys uh, yeah <laughs> the, the schedule works <laughs>